Canadian cliche. Canadian cliche. Hi, I'm Canadian. It's nice to meet you. Now you think you know me. I apologize a lot. Hey, I'm sorry. That's just who I am. I might say house and about a little bit differently than you guys, but there are some things that you think us Canadians do that are just downright dumb. And I'm about to prove all of you wrong. Or right. Who knows? Let's go see. Okay, so what do you think a Canadian cliche is? Living in igloos. <laughs> oh, I apologize for everything. Uh, like hockey? Like hockey, you think every Canadian can play hockey? Maple syrup and riding polar bears. I'm gonna prove you all wrong. You say the Canadians eat maple syrup with everything on it. There's no way this is gonna taste good. Twinkies, there's like a cheese weird burrito thing. My puke, this is for you guys. Stay. Oh, garlic stuffed olives. Twinkie with maple syrup. I'm just gonna pour it on in. Yep, that's gross. Here we go. That's really rank. <laughs> this might be a spit bucket one. <laughs> Need something to wash all of this nasty food down with, so here we go. This is like a crappy burrito. It's like falling apart. It's not even staying together. Cheers. It's actually good. <laughs> like I would eat this whole thing probably with maple syrup on it. Let's see, I'm taking another bite. <laughs> that was good with maple syrup on it. You think that all of us for some reason know how to play hockey. Well, you know what? That's not always true. Okay, there you go. Just a little, couple little steps. <laughs> ah, we can all pretty much play. I hope you all learned a very valuable lesson at my expense set. You know? I'll admit, we say A a lot. Probably eat a little too much bacon, and maybe sometimes we're even too polite, but those are things that I can live with. I'm very proud to be Korean. You have any maple syrup? So this is my stop, which is a house, surprisingly not an igloo. I don't even know where you guys come up with this stuff. Like and subscribe to my channel and I'll keep on putting stuff out. I don't know what it's gonna be. I really don't know. I'll see you guys next time.